What is up everybody, Ph Games here and welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange. In the last episode, we started our adventures here at Blackwell Academy and we learned the fact that we can rewind time. It's very really interesting because there's a girl who is about to get there was a girl who's about to get shot, but we stopped it. That's us. That's amazing. And I'm very happy about that. Okay, so I can remove, I can rewind time, I can rewind faster, I can, I can go to the, I can press LB and that goes, uh, whilst rewinding and that goes to the last part I can rewind to, like checkpoints. Okay. Let's go. Leave. I always remember the fire alarm going off in my school. It was hey, not do you hear that annoying. fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Okay. Principal saved me this time. Let's go and talk to him. Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. Hmm. Does he hate me? I don't think so. But you look a little stressed about. out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. Are you sweating pinballs? Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Um... Hi... Should we hide? I mean, you probably won't believe us if we said anything, so let's hide. I just got sick in class. Oh, uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. No, um. he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Let's do this. Let's rewind. Ah, if I let go, it does it. Okay, speak. You look a little stressed out. Uh, report Nathan. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw yeah. everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... Then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is... A serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything, since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Principal Wells always looks so mm. distracted. I can never figure I like out that what ending. he's thinking. I like that Does ending better, 
but it still doesn't get me anywhere. The butterfly says this action will have consequences. I like the fact that you can rewind and change sort of ideas. I like that. It's kind of cool, if you will. Is there anything else I can look at whilst I'm here? Before I move on. Uh, before I move on. Max, you better go on outside now. I will go outside on my own time, Principal Wells. I will go outside on my own... Alright, fine. I will go outside. I will go outside. Here. I went outside. And that means there's a checkpoint. When there's a checkpoint, you cannot go back. I remember that from last season. There we go. Things are starting to be looked. Issues are starting to be looked at. Posters over posters? Somebody really wants to find Rachel Amber. Hmm. I would so be there if a Sasquatch actually did battle a Razorback. I would be there too. Because that sounds like fun. But it's probably not like that. I talked to Hayden. Look. There's Hayden in his Vortex Club harem. He oh, sure is, hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Okay. Um... The Vortex Club. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? Seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night. Then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. Um. You mean hang with the Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Chillax, yeah. Memory, girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. Um. Talk about Nathan. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Yeah. Um, he seems a bit unstable. He seems though. genuinely unstable to me. Nate has his extreme moments, but don't we all? I don't know yet, Hayden. Rachel. So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. Okay. What happened? Was Nature in the Vortex Club? Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. Uh, did Victoria like Rachel? Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. Uh, what happened to What her? do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. I'm more confused than before. It's such a mystery. Let's talk later, Hayden. That it is, Max. Now, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Hmm. Interesting. Learned a lot from that. Ooh. That's Miss Grant. I talked. Look. Miss Grant sure is dedicated to that petition. And Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? 
Um, sure, why not? Sure, We've got time. I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Yes, I agree with that. Um, but there is there David are Madsen things. doesn't need another excuse to harass students here. Max, this isn't about personalities. This is about protecting civil rights and our school's legacy of freedom. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Um, is Blackwell that old? Blackwell is that old? That's incredible. You should learn a little history about your alma mater. You'll find some fascinating facts. There's a lot of power in this region. I think it helps the creative juices flow around here. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Um, you know what? This consequence may have actions, but sure, why not? I'll sign Absolutely. the petition. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. This action will have consequences, but I'm okay with the consequences of this action. Thank you very much, I game. Warren's text okay, so there we go. <laughs> Better read. Wow. He's needy. Very needy. Very needy. <laughs> That must have cost him a lot in his phone bill. This was probably was back in the days where you had to pay for your credit, unless he's got a contract phone. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Um, Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different styles. Okay. Ooh, new pages added to my journal. Interesting. Nice. Sets up thing. Sets up a backstory really well, and it's actually kind of fun. And that's all Monday. Um, so. Anyone else I can talk to before I head down to. Oh, Daniel. Daniel's here. Look. Daniel is always drawing something. He makes me look like an extrovert. And now. What's speak. up, Daniel? Oh. Hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. Um, I would be honored. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Hmm. Knew her? You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait, oh, she was a natural. Um, not to avoid, Hard her, to posters. avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. What happened to her? So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way. You're a good substitute, Muse. Okay, cool. Use TM90. So use substitutes. Oh, that's a good posture. Good. Good. Yes. I could say something, but I'm not going to. Nice. Best portrait ever. It's very nice. If this is a video game, it doesn't explain why you drew it so quickly. 
This action will have consequences again. Game, I'm okay with the consequences of this action. You need to stop telling me this action will have consequences. I understand that, but I'm, but some of the things I'm okay with. Oh, squirrel, squirrel, an American gray squirrel. Because the, all gray squirrels are American. Nice. Hello, squirrel. Wish I could take a picture of you and all, but like I can't because it won't allow me. But like, you enjoy that tree. Um. Ooh. Hey, Brooke. Look. Brooke actually has a drone. Nice. Drones are a big thing now these days, and I, I like them. At least this game doesn't talk about fidget spinners, because I don't like them. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Um, is it legal? Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Of course. Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a weapon of war? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Um, let's rewind and actually fly the drone. Rewind quicker. Speak. Hi, Skip. I'd love to. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? Yes, uh, I know what, what a drone is. Right? Uh, no. You read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Hmm. Either way, I seem to get stopped by stopped by this. I'm Ooh. almost sure Warren has the same bag. It looks a bit nerdy, though. Okay. What Look a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Hmm. Ooh, I have new information. Now, if I rewind... With my new information, and speak Have again. Me. Let me guess. It's a high fly drone. That looks like a high fly drone, model B four hundred EVO. Now that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. Okay, and now we're flying a drone. This is actually really cool. That's it. up. There we go. That's really, really cool. I like that. The game allows me to fly a drone. That's awesome. I get some amazing thumbnails out of this. Oh, it's, it's so cool. Up. And you go up because I'm flying too low. Flying too low. There we go. Am I actually controlling this? I'm probably not controlling this. It makes I make it seem like I am controlling this, but I'm probably not controlling this. It's probably a demo. It makes it seem like I'm controlling it, but I'm probably not controlling it. And it goes around again. That's really cool. Thank you, Brooke, for that. That was rather cool. I like that. It makes it seem like it was, uh, you know, I was controlling it, but I'm not. So, interesting. Ooh. Can I talk to anyone else? What about these skaters here? Can I talk to them? Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Um, Thrash? Thrash? You mean stage diving or? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Hmm. Let's rewind. Uh, let's look. There's Justin and his skater posse. 
They're so cute doing their tricks. Hmm. Yo, Justin. No. Check out the max. Come to thrash? Um. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh. Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't. Okay. Now I know more. And I can see all the consequences of my actions. We're done talking. You're too sketchy. I am far from sketchy. Um, now speak. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. Come to thrash? Um, yeah, I can do no slide. I can do no slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah, I just can't skate worth shit. Oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Uh, I want to see the nose. Go for a flip. tree flip. Let's get yeah, Trevor all tree over flip. that action. Oh, ow. Oh. oh dear. This action has consequences. This, and we see the consequences of those actions. Yo, Justin. Check out the mag. Okay. No slide. I came to no slide. Oh, sick. You're not. Nah. Ah, oh, check. Um, no slide. I'd love to see a no slide. Let's get Trevor all over that action. <laughs> yeah. There we go. There we go. And he's not hurt himself. He's fine. He's good now. That's for winding. That's the power of a wind. We d we save people from hurting themselves. The power of a wind, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, let's go and let's go and go to our dorm now. But we've seen the power of rewind in action, saving the world, one skateboarder at a time. Oh, I forgot I still have my running shoes. I still passed the first gym and I still have my running shoes. Ooh, look. Oh, that's not nice. Poor little otter. Yeah, it's not nice at all. Especially since sharks and otters would not be in the same water. Just want to mention that. Sharks and otters would and not be anywhere near otters each other. Perform their aquatic magic. Otter power? I'm so not there. Yeah, I'm not either. They sure get a lot of mileage out of otter power. Yeah, a bit too much if you ask me. Anyway, let's go to our do let's go to our dorm. Cigarette what's look. Gross. At least switch to E6. Oh yeah, that was a thing, Bounce. How do I get to my dorm? Run. Run, Max, run. Uh, fountain. Sit. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow, I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Hmm. It's really interesting. I'm gonna get up now. But it's quite interesting to figure out why we we did what we did. Look. Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. Good for her. And now speed. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Um, I think so. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. 
Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Sure you would. Um, now that you mention it... Now that it, you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. Yes, you have a lot to learn good. here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well... I heard that from a good source. Okay. Um. You know Rachel? So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Hmm. Interesting. Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. I'd like to study this photo if you don't mind. Very interesting. Learning a lot. Um, can I go and talk to that guy? Ooh, I can. Graffiti, Clever. look. Uh, look at That's Luke. That's Luke Parker. Zachary pushed him into a locker last week. Go bullies. Uh, uh hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. Uh, what's wrong? What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. Yes, you, you we know him. both agree on that. Um, I busted I him? I busted him today with a gun. What? Seriously? I saw him wave a gun around today, and I went to the principal. We'll see what happens next. You are my new hero. Finally, karma comes to Blackwell. Hmm. This action may have consequences. I'm glad you told me that, Max. Let's talk later. Cool? Cool. Actions may have consequences, but again, okay with consequences of actions. Signpost. Look. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. Then let's go there. Logan, bring it, bro. Yeah. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. I know you do, Max, but I also need to end today's episode because we've gone about half an hour. So that is where I'm going to end today's episode. So in today's episode, we learned a lot about Blackwell Academy. We signed a petition. We flew a drone. That was rather fun. And we saw some people do some gnarly skater tricks. And if you enjoyed, you can leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you're on YouTube, if you're on Vidme, you can leave an upvote. You can follow the channel. And, of course, you can leave a comment over there as well. And, of course... We will be getting through this game probably like two episodes per week, maybe something like that. I don't know, but we'll honestly see. I'm trying to get through this as quickly as I can so I can play. The new life is strange when that comes out, but I'm still going to try and enjoy the original life is strange whilst I still have it. I guess I'd have both at the same time as well, but like, you know, all the heat will be on the new life is strange when that comes out, so... We'll honestly see what happens. Anyway, until next time, I'm just BH Games. And I am out. See you again.